After you get the links, which you will find on the page, you want to go into them, which are going to be the forge and your mod pack. So, in this case, you have the Guns and Space mod pack. You just want to please download. To press download, it's going to download right here. You want to accept this. And you just want to download the recommended one, which is going to be here. You just wait three seconds. You download that. When that's done, I'll tell you what to do, guys. When you have the forge ready and the mod pack ready, what you want to do is you want to put them here and you want to first do this. You want to start this, press yes, and just press OK. Then press OK. Then you want to go to Minecraft, make sure you're signed in and select the Forge 1.7.10 or whatever version the Forge is uh, for your mod pack. I'll press play. When Minecraft is launched, it should be working and you should only have these uh, three uh, things in here. So you want to now quit. Now you want to go to percent update percent like here and press enter. I want to find dot Minecraft and I press that and you should find a mods folder. If there is no mods folder, you just create new folder name it mods. I want to go into here and it should be empty. You want to open this which is going uh, to be a zip file and you want to take all those, copy them, or you can just do this and post them here. After that's done, you want to close this, close that, and your mod is going to be, mod pack is going to be ready. And you want to make sure you're launching with a correct version, you want to press play. Now everything should be working. You should um, ask the person who you're going to play with to do the exactly same thing. And this is going to be for a local. So uh, go to your friend's computer or go in your second computer where your friend is going to be playing and do the exact same thing. Make sure you have the mods, the same exact mods, and you have everything the same. That's very important. Now you want to quit. And I'm just going to go do it on my second computer, and I'll be back. Hello everyone, uh, it's me again. Uh, I'm just going to go over what I just did. So basically, as you know, I installed the Forge, and I installed the mod pack in the mods folder in Updata. And now I'm just going to launch my Minecraft. Also, I just found out something while I was installing on my second computer. Uh, if you have uh, a 1.7.10 uh, version that's a different from this one, from the installation, right, or your other versions, you need to remove the this uh, the one that's not correct. So if you have 1.7.10, uh, 1614, and you need the 1558, then you want to remove the si pretend this is the 1614. You want to remove it, then you want to uh, do this again. Do yes, and you want to press OK, install it again, so that you, um, so that you can launch your launcher with the correct version. Please keep in mind that you need to have the same version with your friend of Forge, otherwise it's not gonna work. Be that in 1.7.10 or other versions like 1.9, you both need to have the same version. So now I'm gonna start this on this computer. At the same time, I'm gonna start this on my laptop, which is, let's just say, that's my second computer. So as you can see, we have the same version. I already pre-installed the mods, so we're just gonna press ready. 
So right now I'm launching Minecraft from both computers on different accounts, guys. So we're just gonna try to play locally. We're on the same Wi-Fi network, so we should be able to play. Let's just wait for it to load. This one's gonna take some time. My computer is already done. So while that's being done, let's just launch this. So we wanna go, uh, let me check. Uh, okay, not multiplayer, we wanna go single player. And then we wanna uh, create new world. Let's name it test. Oh, sorry, you can see right here. Just watching my laptop right now. It's launching right now, as you can see. Test, let's make it creative. Actually, let's keep it survival, right? As you can see, let's leave that all on. Test, create new world. As you can see, this just launched 36 mods, the same thing. So let me just launch this again. Just hold on, guys. Oh, this is a bit, <laughs> a lot of stuff. So, yeah. Let me just launch this. Let me get the world set up and I'll be back. Hello guys, I'm back. I just made a new world. Um, so yeah, the first time it crashed, so I just I just remade the world again. So it should work. It should work. I tested the mod pack, so it should, everything should be working. Um, so yeah, now it's the, I'm in the world. It's survival. Sorry, creative. And I'm just gonna do open to LAN. So uh, settings for other players. Let's just put survival for now. The start LAN world. So here's the port. Don't actually need that. So. Uh, Make sure you're in the same Wi-Fi network, right? So if you go here, that's my laptop. We're gonna go multiplayer. Uh, let's just press allow. Uh, just hold on. Uh, F11. Uh, as you can see, LAN world picks three. That's my world, and I'm gonna join it with this account. As you can see, I'm in the game. I can probably see my other player, so let me just try walking. The settings a bit bugged because I need to actually go and do the controls because you can see many mods override each other, but you can you can easily just adjust these. But as you can see, we are together in the world. We can see each other. We can play with this. And then, as I'm a host, I can just log out, save and quit. And we both disconnect, so we can both play. As you can see, there's a tower right there from the mod pack. So yeah, that's basically it. If you want to play with a friend on not the same network, I mean Wi-Fi, then yeah, watch my other video for doing it on a server where your friend can join it. But yeah, that's gonna be it. As you can see, everything's working. That's my laptop, yay, and that's my computer. So uh, leave a like if you enjoyed, and that's gonna be it.